this black box that you see here at the intersection, that is housing the, uh, the smart intersection equipment. Uh, when we come back, if you look on top of these two traffic uh, lights that are directly above my head, there's antennas on top of those. Uh, one is a communications antenna, the other is a GPS antenna. The navigation system, you know, some are hard drive based, some are DVD based. Okay. Um, some are DVD based. That information, when, when it's downloaded once, it's stored. You mm -hmm. don't necessarily have to download that again unless the map changes. If there's a, a let, let's say uh, the county came out here and added a turn lane. Or, mm -hmm. or change the lane markings. They would then update the map and your vehicle when it went by that intersection. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. No, no. Got sped yeah. up there. You see the light? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's very, it draws my attention right to the windshield, which, you know, I'm looking for stop signs and pedestrians. Stop sign. Ew. So if any of you have ever driven the, uh, or seen the Volvo S80 with the Ford collision warning system, yeah. If you were getting too close to a vehicle in front of you or, or getting ready to collide, this particular type of alarm would go off and you would see that flashing light and it immediately draws your attention to the front. Now, okay. uh, eventually you could imagine this evolving into, and, and a lot of people aren't willing to give up control of the vehicle, but so, uh, you know, for someone that's not not going to stop by the, by the stop, stop sign or stop light, there are systems out there that can take control of the brakes for you to, to slow the vehicle, but we're taking it one step at a time. You know, you know, uh, people are willing to give up some level of control, but you know, you, you, you gotta you gotta go slow. You, you can't just go immediately from having no system at all right to autonomous braking, is what we refer to it as. I noticed in the S80 when I had it, if I was going on a kind of a curvy route and someone was in the left turn lane, a lot of times that light would go off and the and the brakes would start to apply okay. when I was just driving through an intersection. Right. It, it, that's a tough problem because the vehicle is turning off and what's happening is that vehicle is being locked for a certain period of time and then once it disappears it has to be it has to be gone for a certain period of time right so there are they're they're augmenting that with vision based systems so that system used to just be radar mm -hmm. and now it's actually going to be augmented with a camera that's going to to verify the, the information that the radar is giving to, to, to the vehicle so all right let's try to run this this stoplight here <laughs> Stop like.